Hello everyone, you're watching Must Read TV, where we present to you one book in one minute. This week we have a new cycle of classic books. These are books that have been chosen by the editors, so if there's some other book that you want to see, make sure you leave it in the comments below. Today we have Tess of the D'Urbervilles by Thomas Hardy. This episode has been brought to you by Lit World, digital global publishing house. So let's start. A pure and sweet Victorian girl named Tess is raped by a man that she doesn't love and she becomes pregnant. Eventually the baby dies and she gets over that part of her life. Then she gets remarried to a man named Angel. He treats her well until he finds out that she's been tainted and he doesn't want her anymore. Eventually he abandons her and leaves her life in ruins. So I give this book 5 out of 5 for the plot. This book is set during the Victorian period in which female chastity is the most important thing in society. Hardy seems to start questioning this period of society which helps his plot along. I give this setting 4 out of 5 stars. Tess represents a female ideal during the Victorian period, whose life is ruined anyway by the hands of men in her life. Tess seems to be the standard representation of womanhood during the time, but she still fails to have a happy life. Angel is also a very interesting character. While he does love her and means her no harm, Hardy still uses him to show the way that a man can still hurt a woman even when he doesn't mean it. So I give this book 5 out of 5 stars for characters. Let's sum up Tess of the D'Urbervilles by Thomas Hardy with 5 stars for plot, 4 stars for setting, and 5 stars for characters, I give this book a total of 4.6 stars. That makes Tom Tess of the D'Urbervilles a definite must read. Do you think this book is still relevant today? Let us know what you think in the comments below. And if you like this video, please like and subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button. And we'll see you next time.